Hey, hello there, I'm Aldra Hill, and welcome to Europe Indoor's House for Olivia Achievement. Olivia Achievement is something I've been working towards with my stream at twitch.tv slash Aldra Hill. I'm actually recording that live from there, right now. So what the achievement is, is uh, basically what my girlfriend does, or did, rather. She is from Naples, or the Naples region. Then I'm going to form Italy by playing as Naples and forming Italy, and then by a roundabout way conquering England and forming Great Britain. That is the overall path, because obviously now she lives in Great Britain, I thought it would be kind of fun. Naples is a very, very fun uh, country to play as, because they start under a personal union of Aragon, and it's very dependent on the start you get, who's going to support you, who's going to love you, and then how you can advance militarily from that point. It is very hard, it's not, it's not very hard, but it is a hard start. It's not very forgiving, but... It could be a lot of fun. You have to watch out for the Ottomans. You've got to watch out for a lot of different people. Hey, well, Fiona Chief, welcome to the stream. Thank you for joining me. So, I'm like I said, I'm recording this live from my YouTube, uh, Twitch channel, so I will be making comments about that all the time. So, I'm going to call it Olivia Achievement. Let's do it. Oh, shit, I actually already, got, I actually already have an Olivia Achievement file. Uh, I'm going to call it YouTube. Because I um, did one already, but then it kind of failed because the, I did it only on Twitch, and then essentially it died when the game I dated. No restarts allowed or fishing. Oh dear. Fishing, if people do not know, is when I, uh, if, is the occasional thing of when you crash the game. But we shall not do that. No, of course not. We're never going to do that. We're not monsters. We're terrible people. So it's a hard game. It's a hard start, but I'm looking forward to it. Uh, it all depends, of course, what start we get. So it's actually been a little while since I played E4 as well. So let's just go through it and as one and everything else. So I air, currently our ruler is, uh, Alphonse the Trastamere, but that's simply because we are under a personal union, so we have the same. Ruler, so it's not very interesting, so don't really pay any attention to that. But we can't break away until 1447 when the truce is up, and to be able to do that, we need to basically hire a bunch of soldiers and move everyone all in the correct direction we need. Now, the real question is, who's going to support us? Who will support us? Let's, first of all, no country will support for our independence just yet. Hmm. First of all, let's take a look. Who is Aragorn's rivals? They are Cass... Ah! That is decent. It's Castile. Good stuff. Sometimes it's not Castile. Sometimes Castile decides that they're actually going to be buddy buddy. Da -da 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 -da. What am I doing? So, support independence. Yes, but obviously I can't because it's a truce currently. Let's just go around the room and take a look and see who would support me. Austria is apparently 100, minus 120 because of relations. One thing you could do is you can try to improve relations with Austria as well. The Papal State does not want to for some reason. Because the papal ruler is cruel. Ah, oh, what? Douche. I often find that they actually ally with uh, the Aragonese during this, which is a bit of a problem. But we're going to give it a go. We're going to give it a go. Is there literally anyone who wants to support me? No, there isn't. Okay. So it's a very basic start, this. Um, there's not really a lot you can do otherwise. Going to obviously protect trade in the Genoa node. Yep, Genoa's the best one. Uh, obviously, we have we have merchants gathering every which way possible. One nine two. Just keep that up there. And the main thing is to also try and just improve relations with as many people as possible because you're going to want to basically really get people to like you. Possibility is some, another Italian power because I do sometimes find that papal state will ally them, but they're actually oh, they're actually rivaled with Aragon, so they won't ally Aragon, but they won't help me because they're cruel. What a jerk. If I can overcome the neutral relation, I might be able to get them, so let's do it. Uh, on, so basically, only Castile will help me. Yeah, Burgundy is also the possibility, but they're way too far. Because this is the thing, they can't actually reach Aragon, even though they're rivals. They can't actually reach them, so it's not useful at all. England would actually support me, and that would actually be helpful for some naval power, and also just for bringing over strength of alliances. But we're going to have to wait a little while. Mm, is there anyone else who might support me who's at least within range? No, not really. That's okay. I'm also going to improve relations with England. And the overall goal here is to try and get back our cause in Sicily. And a couple other things. So one strategy here... Well, one strategy is just, you know, just take these and just carry on in, in the Italian peninsula. But I have a much better strategy that I really, really enjoy. Which is, uh, when you beat them horribly and destroy them immensely, get back all these cores that I own. I think I can actually only take the three. Uh, get war reps to try and deal with the fact that I'll probably be in debt from this war. And also take Roussillon. Uh, Roussillon is a great little province to take because it's a hill, but you can release it as Catalonia. And all of these provinces are Catalonia. So then every other war with um, Aragon, you can just constantly feed it provinces. This is really good. Yes, Ivan, this is indeed going to be going onto the YouTubes. 
So we have our little troops here. Obviously, we're going to lower our maintenance to try and make, make as much money as possible. We're going to mothball the remainders of our fleet. We have a mission to solidify our papal relations to get papal influence. Ooh. Dip rep. Dip rep is super good for what we're trying to do here. So actually, yeah. So maybe actually we should not do it with these guys. That's all right. And that's basically all we're going to really do. I and mean, we do actually have quite a bit of money. So we could try and get an advisor. But generally speaking, the advisor is only going to be useful when the war starts. Um, I prefer to have a big bulk of money. Though the military point gain is actually very useful because I will have it by 49. Which means I'll have the next tech by the time we actually get to conflict. So I will get a military advisor. Yes. Okay. Let's do it. And obviously we're going to turn off our fort. We can support an additional four regiments. So let's just go to max speed and hope it goes well. Ar Aragon will ally... Yeah, I'm sure Aragon will ally France and Ottomans. And they have allied France. Oh dear. Oh, last jousting tournament. That's very nice. Last jousting tournament is a really good thing to get because 10% morale is super sexy. However, they have allied Hungary and France, which is not great for me. But it's damn well worth a try. You know what? I said to myself I was probably going to restart the game if necessary. But you know what? No, I'm not going to restart this time. What? What's happened? Oh, the king died. Alright. I don't really care. <laughs> Hopefully what should happen is that France will get into a war. Yep, there we go. France will get into war with England, which means they will not be able to help out. Which is good. Sort of Maine. Yay. Oh shit, we've been called into the war. Oh no. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, so we've now been called into the war as well because we are on Aragon's side. So this isn't great. Oh dear. Oh, so I might, I might maybe overdriving a little bit. I'm a little bit close to my microphone. I apologize, my friend. Thank you. I'm going to have to sit defensively and hope that eventually we can... Oh, I've not... I not my arm... Oh, yeah, my arm minutes was increased again. I was hoping that France would be stuck in this war, but they called in Aragon unnecessarily, and it means that they're going to get dragged into the war. This is unfortunate. Disappointing, I must say. Oh, well. Well, we can get Castile. Well, the thing is, we actually can get Castile and England as well. Yeah, Lithuania's become a junior partner. Yeah, I can still declare independence. It's just going to be a bit of a slog. Oof, they've got some allies, haven't they? Alrighty, let's do this. To be honest, the only real thing we can actually do is invade into Messina. Let's see how we can do this. Welcome back, Falco. Still got a couple of years to go. And we're going to have to see how the war goes, but we're not going to be. cannot declare war on them. Oh dear. Province has been excommunicated. Oh no. But obviously, England will get wrecked because they never do anything. It's not, for, it's, not, it's, not, it's been patches and patches since the AI has actually been decent at attacking France and actually doing the Hundred Years' War properly. Uh, Ever since in my EU4, Castile integrated Naples and I broke the PE between Aragon and Castile before they emerged and Austria is now trying to take it. Oh, joy. All right. Oh, well, I didn't improve relations with Papal State. Well, we all make mistakes, don't we? It's all right. You all make mistakes. It's not going to go super well, guys. I'm not going to lie to you. And yeah, there may be some whoopsie doodles. There may be some whoopsie doodles. Oh, now because the king died, I don't have as much military points. Military points. Ah, oh, damn. So I'm not going to get the tech that I need. But neither is it. Neither is Aragorn, though. So that's okay. All right. When's the truce up? It's still. It's still May. Rightful ownership. Request it. Oh. Oh. They're going to give us Messina for free? Oh, they gave us Messina for free! <laughs> oh, that means we can get way more stuff. So, Fennekin, welcome back to stream. Thank you for joining me. Yeah, France is in a defensive war. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Which means I can't rebel against them, which is unfortunate. All right, now we're going to, we're going to need to uh, recruit a few extra soldiery doodles. Up to the force limit at least. Yes, so good. It means not attacking over straight, which means I can just easily take this. So good. Alright, cool. Now let's see how we can do here. Ah, oh, that is amazing. States to one control provinces. Oh, could you piss off? 
All right, we'll give you this bad boy right there. Happy? Here you go. Just need mortar. All right. The truce of Aragon is over. Unfortunately, they still do not want to support me. Which is very sad. Right. So it's only Castile who will support me. That's quite depressing. Crimea might. Oh, no. So it does look like it's just going to be that. But look at all the people who get called in. France and province would all join. That is such a big deal. We are almost certainly going to die here. But we're going to go out swinging. We're going to go out swinging, ladies and gentlemen, okay? That's what we're going to do. Sparrowhawk, welcome back to the stream. Thank you so much for joining me, my, my friend. My friend. I, just, I kind of tie between my friend and my buddy. Because it's live for YouTube right now. Well, it's possible that Castile's armies might be able to get there fast enough. I'm considering just declaring war right now. Like, literally this second. It's tricky stuff. It's tricky stuff. Damn France. Because they might, they might stay there. You know, they might stay there. But almost certainly they won't. Ah, uh, this is terrible for us. But we have to make it work somehow. We have to try it. France is not going to get us for any war exhaustion. England would support us, however. But they won't... Mm. France won't disarm at the moment, no. We could try and get for an, an, hope for an English help. Wait for the war to end, then get English support, and then go jump straight into another war. And see how that goes. Because the England naval superiority will at least give us blockading power. What's up, Eddie Vegs? Uh, see how it goes. Not gonna lie, I'm pretty nervous about this. We just have to wait. We're gonna wait for the war to be over. It is possible that it's not gonna be a likely thing here. Get back, thank you for that follow, buddy, and welcome to the stream. Lovely to have you. Uh, it's possible this is not gonna be a success. Though I have the strategy down. I've done it quite, for quite a few times before, but this time it doesn't look like it. Generally, oh no, I don't care. Generally, you need France to not ally Aragon, and you need someone else other than Castile to support you, either Papal State or Austria. Without one of those... Now, Austria doesn't want to help me for some reason. They're real douchebags. Neutral attitude towards Aragon. I can't change that. I'll lose the prestige. I could wait until I get France to get exhausted, but there's no way they will because England's going to back out really soon. Why won't you support me? Why won't you love me? If the Pope did die, then the Papal State would support me, and that might be okay. The problem is, is that the Castilian forces, we wouldn't get enough sieges done. We wouldn't, because the thing is, I need to. I don't just need to win. I almost definitely will be able to win, but I need to take all of Sicily and one province of... of um, Catalonian area. Otherwise, my plans kind of get shot. But it's you know it's still worth a try. Ah, oh, Jesus! They're sitting regiments now. Oh my God! Ridic. Let's get a general. Let's try and get some stuff, shall we? Seek support the clergy. Make a donation. I'm going to need to recruit an... Oh, send em yes! Send emissary to the Pope! Beautiful. And we're going to get some money. Nice burrows. We're going to grant monopoly charters. Alright, there we go. Is Kebab in a generous mood? No, Kebab will never help me. They I can't even reach it. <sighs> come on, baby, come on. Actually, I will be able to get to over 100 with... Um... Killer Earl, thank you for the follow, buddy. Welcome to the stream. Oh, England's getting really deep in this war. Thing is, I will be able to get to 100. This is the thing. You can get five free heavies and spam galleys. The patch, this patch, AI won't get access. If you beat them at sea, you'll be fine. I could try and spam galleys, actually. That might, might be a good plan. Let's do it. Let's get some spams. I could get five free heavies, but I really don't want to have to pay their maintenance. Hmm. No, I don't want to do it. Alright. 
Look at that. Come on, baby. You know you want to like me. You know you do, people state. Come on. Stop it. Stop being cruel. Ah. God, they get rid of their neutral attitude. Here we go. Come on. Yeah, no, this, this is definitely going to be some more piece. Also, it's possible Hungary might get embroiled in a war. We might wait until um, the Ottoman truce is over. And if they get embroiled in a war with Hungary and the Ottomans, then Hungary won't come and help. And that would be pretty nice. The Renaissance! Hooray! Where did it fire? Wow, I've actually forgotten where it is. Oh my god, I've actually forgotten where it is. There we go. No, what am I doing? I've actually forgotten how to find that map mode. Jesus, it's been a little while since I played E4, so this is me kind of coming back to it. Oh, it's really close to me. Nice. It filmed in Rome. Oh, I'm going to get it early. No, I know it's there. I was just trying to see if there's a, I remember a map mode. I've actually incredibly experienced this game over 2,000 hours. Yeah, it filmed in Rome. That's awesome for me. Look at that. Oh. Yes, because it's a 20 development and an Italian capital and nearby friendly province with Renaissance. I'm going to get that in a couple years. Holy shit. Just try and maintain on their good side. Come on, Pope. Just die already. Get out of here, Pope. Die. Try and spin our influence. Saint proclaimed. Gain stability. That's what I like to see. Let's get some tech. Wow, they're really going in on this war, aren't they? Jesus. It's worth a try, guys. It's definitely worth a try. Okay. Ah, uh, Castile's second Granada. And Morocco! No! Which means they won't come if I call them. No, they will be forced to come, but they won't be able to help very much. So st that stability... Oh my god, England dropped troops. Wow. That stability I just got makes up for the stability I'm going to lose when I break my vows. So that'd be nice. I think I might try and uh, delete some of these. And build a few more galleys. Burgundy will still very much not help out now. They also are at war, remember? Oh no, they're attacking! Oh no, they're attacking England uh, for the uh, for Calais. <laughs> oh no! No, there's no. It's the only thing is papal state, but uh, you have to have the Pope die for that. This is a bad. This is definitely a bad start. Very bad start. But you know, make it work. Make it work. Come papal controller. No, not not gonna happen. Come on, buddy. Ah, uh, looks like Aragon's pulled its forces back. Makes sense. If the Pope if the Pope dies, then it's gonna be fine. If the Pope dies, everything's gonna be okay, because then I can get Papal State and then we'll have a lot of really good value. We'll have a few extra ships that'll just make it worthwhile. Hmm. Nine war enthusiasm actually. Surprisingly. Come on, France. Bit by bit. Burko B, thank you for the follow buddy. Welcome to the stream. Okay, England has peaced out. Giving England, giving them basically everything. Of course, of course. Right. They're still at war with Burgundy. Oh my god! Uh, it doesn't matter, I'm not going to be able to get it. Uh, because of his cruel thing, the, the damage is too much. However, that does remind me I need to, um... I need to set... What am I doing? <laughs> I definitely need to set places of, uh, of interest for me, but... Uh, it's just not going, super, it's not going super well, guys. Yeah, we're going to set these to be interest. Right. Here we go. If England will peace out of this war... So yeah, everyone will join. If England would peace out of that war, then I could get them to support my independence. We're going to have to wait. Oh, it looks like they're actually fighting. Oh, no. Why would you do this? All right. Well, I'm making a ton of cash. That's good. A ton of cash. It's not going well, guys. Tempted to just do it and see what happens. 
It, we have to also wait for Cast to make sure Castile's not fighting anyone. Yeah, we can't do it while Castile's in the war. The hell Portugal's helping though, yeah. Trade reform! Just, just did trade reform so I didn't have to get negative effects. Alright. Why don't you want to help me, Austria? Oh, because you're friendly. Oh my god, screw you. Ooh, they've got some troops here, which means I can beat them up. I should be able to beat them navally, so that's something good. I'm gonna go with my force limit a little bit with uh, infantry. Actually, no, I've already got space because I got I got that Messina, which gave me a force limit. Is it grain? Give me a force limit? No, it's fish. Hmm. Whatever. Come on, Pope, die already. Pope die. England leave war. Yes. Oh, we can't ask them because they've got a truce with Aragon, of course. You son of a gun. Yeah, they're, they're not going to help us. All right, once Castile's out, we're going to jump in the war again. Let's do it. No ifs, ands, or buts, my friends. All right, let's do it. I'm going to get wrecked. But we're going to do it, guys. I'm excited. I'm very excited. Yes, I am. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> All right, we're going to try and get some military support. We can call... Ah, we can't call it Diet, though, unfortunately. That's okay. We are going to recruit an Admiral, though. Hey, he's slightly decent. We're going to wait a couple months. And off we go. We could also embrace Renaissance, but I don't really want to do that. All right, let's get full. let's get full maintenance. There's no time limit on this, we're just going to try it. So, do be sure to check out the next episode, guys. I will be attempting to declare War on the Aragorn. Most likely it's going to be a complete failure, and if it does, I will do redo the series. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. Do be sure to check out all the other series I have on my channel. You can also check out my Patreon, links in the description below, and of course, my Discord. I was Alger Hill, and I continue to be, and this has been some European Universalis for Olivia Tubin. Bye-bye.